In this problem, we're going to compute a weighted mean. So we have a student's final grades in math, physics, English, and chemistry are 81, 84, 92, and 77. If the respective credits for these courses are 3, 5, 3, and 4, find their grade average. So we're going to use the formula for what's called the weighted mean. So I'll denote the weighted mean simply by x bar. And the formula is the following. So it's a fraction. And in the numerator, what you do is you take each weight, so I'll call that W, and you multiply it by the corresponding data points. So in this case, it's the grade. And you add them all up. And in the denominator, you basically just add up the weights. So this symbol here, this just means sum. It just means add up, okay? So here, let's work out the numerator first. So we take the weight times the grade, and then we add, and then repeat. So we have 3 times 81. That's the weight. That's the importance we assign to the grade of 81. So times 81. So because math is a three-credit course, you just take the 3, and you multiply it by the final numerical score. Plus, physics is 5 credits. So that's the importance we assign to the grade. So it's 5 times 84 plus, so 5 times 84, forgot to circle them. <laughs> English is only 3 credits, so it's 3 times 92, plus. And then uh, the last one would be chemistry, there it is over here, chemistry, and that's 4, so 4 times 77. So you basically just take each weight and multiply it by the grade, add them up, and then on the bottom you divide by the sum of the weights. So this would be the sum of, and you're just basically adding up the weights. So 3 plus 5 plus 3 plus 4. So let me go ahead and do that. I don't know why I wrote the uh, thing there. So 3 plus 5 plus 3 plus 4. All right, let's carefully work this out. I have not done this problem yet. So I'm going to type this into my calculator and see what we get. So 3 times 81 plus 5 times 84 plus 3 times 92, plus 4 times 77. So I got 1,247. So let me just double check that. 3 times 81, 5 times 84, 3 times 92, yep. And on the bottom we have 3 plus 5 plus 3 plus 4. So that's 15. So if we work this out, we get 1247 divided by 15, 83.13. And so that would be the final answer. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.